We are back in beautiful Las Serenas, Dominican Republic, and we're here for a special weekend retreat, marking the one year anniversary, and we're bringing people from all over the world. Yeah, it's actually pretty exciting because just a year ago is when we discovered Las Serenas, and I remember coming here and it being this sleepy fishing village, barefoot, like no one's dressed up. And now it has so much diversity and culture. In just a year, there's been so much development with real estate. And that's really why we're here, to explore the lifestyle, the culture, and the real estate market. So we're warming things up. We just checked into Mosquito Beach Bar and Hotel. This is actually one of the first places yeah. we discovered. It's a place where you can check in, have incredible food. I mean, behind us, you have people surfing, the best surfing you're gonna find yeah, here. Yeah, the first the time area. I ever surfed in my life. It was horrible, but it was amazing. We're gonna get some crafted cocktails, the best pizza you're gonna find in town, and then we're gonna watch the sunset, and the sunset is just magical. Let's have some guns. Oh. We just checked in to Mosquito Boutique Hotel. We're here at the bar, one of our favorite spots. Yes. We just ran into drinks. Leo, who just was surfing. I right know. off of the fan. Yeah. We're catching those waves. Yes. We always love it here because the cocktails are so good. I mean, we the first time we ever like I ever got on a surfboard ever was here. I didn't make it. I didn't stand up once, but I think you did, right? Working on it, yeah. <laughs> the second time, yeah. One year ago, if I remember when. Yeah. It was, it was one, year, one ago. year ago. I know. We're ordering some drinks. We're gonna have some pizza. It's the best pizza. And yeah. then my favorite thing to do is to watch the sunset, which is just minutes away. It's gorgeous here. <laughs> What is this? Rum, cocoa, a little nice little dessert. Love it. Um, the pizza was great because we love coming here for the pizza. We had ceviche, another cocktail, and now we're gonna take a dip in the water, a little sunset swim, and then get ready for dinner because one of our really good friends has a restaurant here, El Pasito, and that's where we're gonna have our night dinner. So, yeah, let's go. We just opened the doors to our villa, which is located in one of the prime areas on Cason Beach. And this is an area called Nomadas, which is gated with beautiful villas. The villa that we're at is Ocean Lodge, which features 11 beautiful bedrooms with ensuite bathrooms. And our guests are arriving. Oh my gosh, we have so many things in store, but we're welcoming everybody with a fantastic cocktail, fresh passion fruit, tequila. Ooh. Our celebrity bartender is gonna be making the cocktails. Everybody's gonna get one. We have the chef that's gonna start making some food like around 3.30 and you guys will be able to see what they're cooking. Everything is fresh. And we have so much to do on this 
piece of property. I mean, yeah. I just found out we had a ping pong oh, table, and if you know, know me, game over. it's done. <laughs> You're going to find me at the ping pong table 90% of the time. We have canoes, we have kayaks, Volleyball. we have a pool okay. table back there. I mean, we don't even have that much time at the property because we have so many events because yeah. we're here for, for Dominican Joe's Foundation. So every day we have an event. But when we get back, we're going to be living it up, partying it up, and just enjoying this beautiful property. So I, I'm like in heaven. Are you heaven. ready for a drink? I'm ready. I'm just... I can't, so I can't. Cool. I don't know, don't you feel so good right now? Blessed. Blessed. Thirsty Bartender is coming to you live from Las Terrenas, and today we have a passion fruit margarita made with a reposado tequila, some fresh passion fruit, lime juice, and it's delicious. Cheers. transform this place. We were here earlier today. We stayed at the hotel and just to see what they've done. It's we have just... all of our friends here yeah. that are gathering. Everyone's arrived safely. They have an April little setup Campari here, Campari. Setup. This is basically the first event for the Dominican Joe Foundation, the welcome party, where everybody's gonna come and get to know each other from all over the world. It's such a great group of people. So we're ready to dance the night away and celebrate the kids and just have a great time. So let's go enjoy ourselves. Let's go. to have you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And thanks everybody to be, for being here and for helping us raise funds for our beautiful kids of the Dominican Joe School. Love you all. Cheers and let's have fun. Good morning, it's day two and we just had an incredible workout beach boot camp by our fitness instructor Carlitos. <laughs> no better way than being in paradise, waking up, enjoying the scenery. We have our incredible chef that's cooking up some breakfast. But thank you so much, I'm feeling amazing. I wasn't for you. Yeah. When you come to the Dominican Republic, I wasn't for you. I want to you. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Hola, mi nombre es Carlito. Estoy aquí en la terrena. If you like a training with me, si quieres entrenar conmigo, le vamos a dejar mi, mis información de mi paquete y de lo que tenemos preparado para ti.
anyhow, this is our 10th year, and some of you have been here before and know the story about this place. But in the meantime, uh, the kids are anxious and hungry, so they're going to do their work, I mean, and then they're going to have something to eat if it's here. Once again, oh, for everybody that's here, uh, we've been leasing this property for the last several years, and last year uh, we've entered a purchase agreement to uh, buy this property. Uh, we have a, uh, a match donation, and Sean and his wife Debbie here have put up the first $100,000 match. We have this property under contract for $200,000, and we're, we have to raise about $70,000 more to complete the purchase. The owner is willing to uh, do owner financing, which is obviously what we're doing right now. The objective is to close on the land, and then we're going to build a proper school here. And we can go up three floors, so we'll be able to maximize the space. Plus, we can, we can uh, there's an alley behind these classrooms. We can push it back, so we'll have a courtyard, and that's the vision that we'll have. And you'll see some of that on Saturday night as well. But just so everybody's wondering, that's kind of how this whole works uh, with, with this building and the land. So I'm gonna let the kids start perf their performance, because I know they're hungry, and we'll go from there. the Dominican Joe School. I, this is my first time actually seeing it. We have people from all over. We're giving them the treats, the cupcakes, pizza. They just had the cutest performance for us. We love it. Love the kids. Love the school. And they've actually, this is the 10th year. So we're happy to be here. And for any information, we're going to be putting a link here so you guys can also support this school because they just made an announcement. They put an offer on this land, no longer are they leasing it, and they just have $70,000 to go, and they can start building and expanding the school to three stories and also the back area. So, let's go. Este es el segundo primero. They require that I do a fence for them, separate from the other kids. Yeah, so I had to do this. For $1,000 a year, he presented a kid to college here. Wow. Really? $1,000 a year. So if you want to sponsor a college kid, you know, we, we, are, we are grateful. So, but just $1,000 a year, you know. I don't, my daughter couldn't even buy books with that money. ¿Cómo está la pizza? <laughs> so we just wrapped up at the Jim Dominican Joe School, and that's essentially why we came out here for this event, for the foundation and the charity. And I think it's really amazing to be able to experience and see what they're doing with all the proceeds that we're collecting for this charity. We got to look inside and just be with the kids and dance and perform. We have content of all of it, so we'll share it with you. And it's just, it really is heartwarming. Um, but. I encourage you guys to learn more about the organization, get involved like we have, donate and give back because what they're doing here is fantastic. And and now we're just gonna go enjoy the rest of the day. We have a beach party to go to and we're gonna eat and drink and just have a great time. Got myself a good woman, the kind you don't often find. She understands how to treat a man always got my interest in mind. Lazy day, Sunday morning, as I come down the stairs, I see her there in the kitchen, the smell of coffee in the air. So thank you very much for your support. You guys have been with us since day one for this event, and your continued support means a lot to the success of our organization and what we continue to do, so thank you very much. So thank you for the new rig in a very well air-conditioned car. Okay, it's an incredible day here. We're at Playa Bonita Beach Residences. Uh, we're here with so many of our friends. We just had a beautiful catered barbecue. One of the uh, many lunch, events. and we have live music behind us. 
Bethany, what are we going to be doing? So, a few of our final guests have arrived. So we're going to go back to the villa. We're going to welcome them. And then we have a big family dinner plan tonight. We made sure to incorporate a lot of special moments in this retreat where we can all get together, get to know each other, bond, on top of all the many events that we have going on. So we're excited. That's going to happen tonight. And then we're going to go salsa dancing. I've been working on my moves. I've been taking all my lessons, so I'm ready. Boy, donde quiero con cualquiera, donde sea papi. Boy, donde quiero con cualquiera, donde sea papi. Boy. All right, it's Friday night. We just finished dinner at Alfacito, and now we're at one of the best places to enjoy cocktails at the rooftop at Mosquito Art Bar. And coincidentally, there's a big banger retro party. We have the whole group going here. Let's go. Papi, donde con cual, donde sea papi, boy, donde con cual, donde sea papi. Our group had an incredible time really getting true, authentic experience of nightlife in Las Serenas. We spent time at the retro 50th birthday celebration downstairs. We had some disco music downstairs, went upstairs, danced the night away, and we're now just chilling at the villa. Our chef is preparing an incredible barbecue. We're enjoying this beautiful villa and the weather in paradise and getting ready for tonight's gala, which will be at Porto by Mosquito Beach Bar. Um, all I gotta say is... Mami, ¿qué más? Hay algo en ti que me tiene mal Una belleza que me quema Cuando vaya la nota me estalla Mami, ¿qué más? Hay algo en ti que me tiene mal Sé que anda puesta pa'l problema Dale guaya Que yo te doy falla, falla Bedroom where in principle we're putting in a, a bathtub in the bathrooms the tops in the bathrooms will be made of the same materials so we just had an incredible presentation by my new friend and hopefully colleague soon mike bolin who is a developer here in las serenas he just went over his incredible project pangea and i can tell you exceptional was even an understatement and you want to tell us a little bit about the inspiration behind pangea yeah of course and i mean fell in love with las serenas. yeah well falling in love with the las serenas was very easy uh, when I came here for the first time, it was at night, so I wasn't, you know, I wasn't, I wasn't too convinced. But then I woke up the next morning, saw the beaches, met a lot of people, and right. the friendliness, the beauty of the place. It's, it's what happens to a lot of people, and you know that from experience. Yes. Once you, once you know Las Terenas, it's, it's, yes. it's, it's, it's a place to fall in love with. So consequently, um, I decided with my dad to develop a, a project where what we noticed the thing missing in Las Terenas as such a beautiful location as it is, what is lacking in this market is ultra high finishes and qualities in development. Yes. So that's where we decided we're gonna build something which hasn't been done yet. We're importing absolutely everything from Europe right. at, the highest, at the highest possible standards yes. uh, you can. Um, and that's that's an awful lot of fun. And a lot of the, the brands that you partnered up with were uh -huh. very familiar. In, that's in the state. that's nice to know. Yeah, so. that's definitely nice to know. It's it's a lot of um, from from our experience. Uh, anything which is European yes. is normally being seen as as a lot of quality in the in the U.S. Anyways, so for us that's an, that's an extra plus for the U.S. market. Fantastic. And the Sunday we're going to see the actual site. I can't wait to see those incredible Good. panoramic views. You will. And. Let's head off to our next uh, party we have going on.
All right, today is Saturday night and we're here in Puerto by Mosquito for the grand event, which is the gala in honor of the Dominican Joe Foundation. It's such a beautiful night. Our group looks fantastic for this gala. We're gonna have live music, beautiful auctions, like just wait. I can't wait for you to see the surprise from Leo Estates. Uh, we're gonna have drinks, cocktails, and just dance the night away. So let's go enjoy. Our team's gonna take a cute group shot and we're gonna have a great night. incredible experience that was celebrating the foundation Dominican Joe foundation if this is a 10 years of magic he's been creating we got to meet the graduates who are doing incredible things with their lives in a place that actually started Puerto by Mosquito is where we came for the wedding this is last where we year had our this, wedding. Is this, where, is our one this is where we fell in love with this island and and honestly we, we're just blessed to have all the most important people in our lives here yeah and you know, it's Saturday, it's the Dominican Republic. Okay, what does that mean? It's time to dance. Party, 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 party. <laughs> Perfect.